Hello, and welcome to my Hellblade Senua's Sacrifice commentary walkthrough. I did play this game a little bit, just the first 25 minutes. It's a little spoiler, I don't know if you have seen gameplay or not, but a little bit into the game. You fight some guys, you get infected with the blackness. It's kind of racist, but you get infected. And like, every time you die or you fail, pretty much, this uh, this thing spreads and once it reaches your head, it's game over. You start again. So the options, basic shit. Uh, graphics, we're gonna do 4K, I have a 4K monitor, full screen, everything high. Let's test it out. Uh, my name is Sviedan, well not really, that's just my channel name is Sviedan. And I live in Canada, originally from Bosnia, moved here when I was five. A little, bo little bit about myself is that I work full time, 3 p.m. to 12, Saturdays, Friday, Saturdays, I do like 3 p.m. mountain time. So right now it's 2.42 a.m. as of this recording or this statement right now. And... I do bartending, server, waiter thing like that. Like it's my part-time, full-time job. Six years there. I just got this new computer from iBuyPower.com. I'll have the link in the description of the case or the model that I selected, but I customized it. And my computer specs I will leave into into the description, so all my specs will be there. Uh, I paid, if you want to know the price, I will leave that in there as well. Pretty much, this this is a hobby for me. Like, really, like, I enjoy what I do. I enjoy playing games. enjoy coming home from work. Make a bowl of cereal at 12 in the morning. Yeah, yeah, I'm that guy. And I play. I enjoy myself. Wake up in the morning. I have two dogs. I walk them. Get back if I have time. I'll play. If not, drive around, wash my car, eat, and then I go to work. So yeah, so don't expect much. My voice is disgusting, so you should probably lower your volume down or do like auto-tune or something to make it a little bit better. But I played a bit of this, and each time I play, like, I'm trying to record, but it's not so good. So let's start this, and I'll try not to talk during the dialogue, but they did some patches, and I'll talk, I'll talk as, they, as they start, so... Thank you for watching, and I hope you will enjoy. So let's get this rolling. Hellblade, Sinuous Sacrifice. Here we go. There was an update where you can look before you couldn't look, but now you can look through the boat. Who are you? I'm Sviedan. Oh. the others. Let me tell you about Senua. For her story has already come to an end, but now it begins anew. What's happening with this? It's breathing. It's breathing. It's breathing. You know she's getting closer. You can feel her coming closer. journey deep into darkness. There will be no more stories after this one. What is she doing? Why is she doing this? They're watching. Why isn't she doing that? Why is she doing this for him? Do you see what's going on? He's already dead. Right. Oh, how rude of me. I never told you of the others. You hear them too, right? They've been around ever since the tragedy. That's not quite true. Some are old. Some are new. But they've changed. I think the darkness changed them just like it changed her. Can you 
See, before you couldn't look around with the mouse, but now you can. Up ahead. You see it too. Dead bodies. Yes. It is real after all. Still can't zoom in, but. I think up there is a Fenrir fight. Can you feel it? What is she thinking? I can tell you. She's afraid. Wouldn't you be? You'd think she would get used to it by now after so many years. But the darkness... It just builds onto itself. Growing stronger. You might try and ignore it. Turn away. Let's drink some water. It's always there, just out of sight. Where you're most vulnerable. It's like it knows that just enough light is all you need to see its suffocating power. It would have been crazy if one of these bodies just fell. It'll scare the shit out of me, probably. She's brave to go on this journey on her own. But it isn't bravery that drives her. Bravery only means something to those afraid of death. Then it was fear runs far, far deeper. Finally, dude. Oh my god, I've been listening to that dialogue like six times. Like, fuck. Alright, let's go. Let's get off this boat. Fresh off the boat. Let's go. What is she looking at? Too late to get into the boat and go back. No one will judge her. No one will ever know. Oh, she heard us. Hi. There's no going back. Fenua pushes away a world that conspired to cause so much suffering. There's nothing to go back to, and worse to look forward to. Why don't you join us? Maybe you too have a part to play in this story. Well, yeah, I'm fucking controlling you. Look at these graphics, though, dude. 
Jesus. It's really good for a triple A like indie game. Look at that ass. Mmm. Oh yeah, it's hot. Oh yeah. Awesome. Alright, let's go. Look really clearly. Focus Do not forget you. my focus, story, focus and you'll see. Because your focus, darkness focus. comes from hell. And your fate lies there. They say the burning of a corpse will take you straight to hell's gate. But God's in the The darkness is coming. It yearns for life. Hungers for it. Like a pack of wolves on a hunt. But she's not stopping. So we're recording this with Shadow Play. I'm doing custom high settings uh, in game, 60 FPS. Hopefully it will do that. And I'm doing. Uh, what is it? I'm doing. I'm doing about 50 megabits per second. I tried 130, a 25 minute clip or gameplay of 130 megabits per second or under the normal settings that I use. It's 25 gigabytes. So it's like 10 hours to upload, you know what I mean? So we're stuck with this one. Hopefully the quality is good. And that's where we'll do a final boss fight for sure. The river of knives across which lies the halls of hell. The place they call Helheim. There's probably nothing in that bag. It's all in her head. my monitor I'll uh, in the description I will link to my setup like I said before I'll link the PC the frame and stuff that I use I'll put the specs in the description I will put what monitor I'm using in the description the mouse the keyboard and whatever else like whatever else I have Yeah, it's right up there. The Northmen speak with nine worlds. The world of men they call Midgard. Sky gods dwell in Asgard. The gods of Earth harvest wind and sea dwell in Vanaheim. The good elves dwell in Alfheim. The evil ones dwell in Svartalfheim. Looks so good. The mountain giants dwell in Jotunheim. The fire giants dwell in Muspelsheim. Niflheim is the world of ice and darkness. You don't know where you're going. 
Only the dead dwell in Helheim. And that is where you must travel. Jump. Oh, this part. This part took me a while. I didn't know what to do. I went like up the ladder and stuff. It's not so hidden if you found it, baby. No problem. Tell me your stories again, old friend. I'm listening. The runes seal the gates to hell. Focus your inner eye. And you too will see what's hidden in plain sight. I can see one. Hold it in your mind's eye. Find one like it to open the gate. It's right here. I didn't know all the gills right here, so I went all the way, all the way up there looking for it. God, I'm so stupid, dude. Look towards the gate, and the gate will open. The gate is open. Go through the gate. Go through it. It's dangerous. Follow it. Good work. Six years enslaved in hell. And if I watched the Northmen, learnt their ways. I know you did. You listen when everyone else laughed. My people paid a heavy price. Carry my stories with you, and together we will make the Northmen feel our fury. I died here. I guess it's the same with heights. You can stand on the edge, pretend it's going to be okay. But you know that death is near, waiting for you to make that little slip. You can't just wish things away. When she said that little slip in the first time I played, that's when I fell and died. The world of the dead is ruled by the giantess, Hela, daughter of Loki. The gods feared her bloodline, bad on her mother's side and yet much worse on her father's. So, as a child, the Allfather cast her down into Helheim and gave her power over those who die of sickness, age, hardship, and self-slaughter. This is where I stopped. After the, like, after this fight that's coming up, spoiler, blah, oops. And then after that, that's where I stopped. Push it. Someone's here. 
someone or something. No, this is mine. Thanks forever. I'll give you what you want. I won't resist anymore. Just give him back. No. No. Get up, bitch. Fodder number one. Let's go. What the fuck? Oh, let's go. Oh, get wrecked, son. Oh, look at those combos. You wanna go, bitch? Come on. Oh, you want it? Oh shit, I didn't dodge it. Oh, that's what you get. Oh. Oh shit. And this is where we lose. Oh shit. Can't do anything against these shadows, dude. Like, oh, look at those dodges, huh? She did. A vision of what's to come. Poor Senua. The darkness does not bargain. It does not reason. It is rocked. And now it has taken hold. It will spread towards her head, the seed of the soul, until there is nothing left of her. <laughs> All of her suffering will have been for nothing. It's just a matter of time. She mad. Ooh, that's super effective. Yeah, so this is where we'll tell you about the infection. So every time you die, it spreads. And like it says right here, once it reaches your head, it's game over. Pretty much it just it kills you. And you have to restart from the very beginning. No saves, nothing. You're done. Game over, man. Game over! The hardest battles are fought in the mind. That is what Dillian taught her. 
His head better not be in there. With every defeat, the dark rot will grow and soon it will take her soul. For now, at least, she still has control of her mind. And she will fulfill her vow. Whatever the cost. He's not wrong. Listen to me, Senua. The goddess Hela lies behind the gate to Helheim. To open the gate, you must first face the gods that guard it. The god of fire, Surt, and the god of illusion, Van Raven. Spill their blood to open the gate to Helheim and enter the land of the dead. To open. In the beginning, there was nothing but darkness and bitter cold to the north. Fiery hot to the south. They say the cold formed ice, which melted from the sparks from the south. The power of the darkness gave life to the dripping ice. I'm choosing the right gate. Nice. He comes from a land older than mankind. This is what I, this is the door that I made last time. I saw the trailer and then some of the gameplay of it, and the fire village is crazy. She found the wretched old fool on her way back from the wilds. No cost. It's it's like cross-eyed. pity on him, for he was not long for this world. Like her. Who spoke of his own darkness, the Northmen. All right, so I'm in part one here. Tomorrow I'm gonna try to get some more footage. I have Crisis coming. I have some games on the Xbox One, like Outlast that I purchased but never started. And now that I can do the commentary, I'm gonna try to full blast headphone and try to get my actual reaction from it. And then we'll see from there. But again, all the items that I have will be in the description. So I want to say thank you for coming to my channel, for helping support me, for watching, and for keeping up with me. Now that I got this computer, I can do a lot more. I can do more commentaries. I can transfer some of the stuff from my old computer to try to get Sony Vegas and Photoshop and make some, some better stuff. So again, I appreciate everything that you guys have been doing. I know everybody says it, everybody does it, but it's true. I want to thank you guys for sticking around and for continuing to stick around with me. And hopefully we can get more people and more of the fan base. But again, thank you. And I just, I'm just not so good. I'm not so good at this stuff. If you like the video, let me know. I'll continue. You don't need to like the video. You don't need to subscribe. You don't need to do anything. You can just visit the channel and watch. That's it. Like Again, like I said, this is a hobby for me. I like, it did, like to do it on the side, and I appreciate what you guys coming and viewing and enjoying the content that I have. So hopefully I can produce more. And if you need something or if you want to see something, just let me know. And I'll try my best to get it out as quickly as possible. And I'm going to do more Steam games. I'm going to try to do more free-to-play, give you my opinion, give the link in the description towards the game. I'm going to try to do more of the new releases, see how they are. But for now, we're going to play this game completely, um, give my full thoughts on it, and we're going to do the full walkthrough, and then we're going to do Crisis. So again, thank you for sticking around, for enjoying and for dealing with my voice. So for now, I'm gonna have to say good night and on part two will come up tomorrow. So again, thank you and just, just thank you. That's all I can really say. Until next time.
Ciao, guys.